Hey everybody, today I'm going to do the app review on Video Downloader Pro. Right there. So, I know I've already done the app review on this one, but actually it was a different app um, that had that same name. And the app does the same thing as the other one, but this one actually has a lot more features and is actually a lot better. So let's hop to the app. <clears throat> so um, after you load it up, it will bring up a passcode or like a you know this one with the dots where you connect the dots. Oops. Um, right now, um, when you first get it, um, it comes without a passcode, but you have to enable this in the um, settings, and I'll show you how to do that um, later. So um. Right when you get on, this is your browser that you would go to download your videos. If you are familiar with this app, um, it just lets you download videos. It has the name it says Video Downloader Pro, right there. So it lets you download videos, and then you can watch them on your phone. So like, if you watch it on um, the YouTube app, right there. So watch it on the YouTube app, and then come back to it. Um, it's it won't remember your load that you've loaded it and the nice thing is that it's downloaded you can watch it over and over and over and forever on here so just to go over the um, bottom <clears throat> bar right here you have your browser where you download your videos downloads for everything downloading files where all of your um, videos are stored you can also create playlists and settings so before we go any farther, um, I just want to show you um, how to turn your passcode on. So you have this passcode lock right here, you have to enable that. Passcode lock type. Choose that and choose if you want um, a pin passcode or a um, dot passcode like this one right here. Where you just connect the dots. Okay, just like that. And then when I go back, I can go in here, connect the dots, just like that. Um, here you can Wi-Fi transfer, so you can transfer your um, your downloaded things over Wi-Fi. And you got a whole bunch of other things. What's nice is that you have private browsing, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, <clears throat> memory, remembering your history. Um, can choose things um, about new pages and everything. All the stuff that you can look at when you get um, this app here. Um, so, um, let's go back to the browser. And the way you download or save a video on here is like um, the same way you would download or save a picture to your phone. You just tap and hold that video until um, you get that thing that pops up. So, like, if I want to. Just do a video of the iPad for. Then you can load this right here. Then say you want to find a video. There's a video somewhere. <clears throat> the iTunes 11. Try to find a video to download here. Okay, so this is the what's new video. So you just play, oh, you just click the play button like you would do on any video. It loads that up, and the way you do it is you just tap and hold that. You get that spinning box, and then um, you get some options. You can download the video, which is what we're going to do here, which is the purpose of this app. Or um, you can open it or copy the link. Let's download it. Choose this name. I'll just keep this right here. Save. See it flash the downloads right here. Um, it has your download right there. And so download. There's nothing in there because it's not downloading. They actually download really, really fast. So it's nice. And so you have this right here. Um, you have now playing like you would just have um, on 
your music app. Um, you can sort these by name, type, size, or date. And um, you can make new folders. Choose from actions, import, select all. Then you would just play it. And um, for some reason, the videos from Apple just says the format is not supported or the file is broken. Um, but this is just what I was going to show you for the video purpose. But um, of course, if you can find ones that work, then this would definitely work for this. Um, and also, um, since the uh, um, YouTube videos are copyrighted, you can't um, download them. So don't want to do that. And then, like I said before, you can make your playlist, add a playlist just like that, put your stuff in there. And that's it. So um, this is pretty much it um, about the app here. Um, so if you like this app, it is three ninety nine um, in the um, App Store. So um, if you like this app, I'll have a link in the description below. Uh, special thanks to people who sent me this app's review. Yeah, I like this a lot. This app a lot so much. Um, so um, do you have any questions? Be sure to leave a comment in the description below. Like this video. And subscribe for more. So this was the app review on Video Downloader Pro. Thanks for watching.